and welcome once again to another edition of the Red Run and Williams Real Estate Show. I'm Shannon Deskins along with Jennifer Brown Day and I say once again but today that has more meaning than ever because we realized a few minutes ago this is our 100th show. It is which is absolutely crazy. I think we figured out we've been doing this over three years. Yes. It's just nuts. <laughs> And, and I think it has done well because you say now some people, when they list their homes with you guys, they're like, hey, can we put this on the real estate show? So apparently we have some viewers <laughs> out there. I hope so. I think we have a few. And thank you all very much for watching it so that we can uh, continue doing the show. And as with every show, we've got five listings uh, to talk about today. And sometimes they're listings. Sometimes they're auction opportunities. <laughs> Sometimes they are rental and lease opportunities, which we have one of those today. So I know you guys try to make sure that you get everything out there that someone would be looking for. Exactly. And we do a lot of different real estate. It's not just mm -hmm. listing and selling. So we want to make sure that we show everything that Ray Brown and Williams has to offer on our show. All right. Well, let's get started today. The first one that we're going to talk about is a listing out of Paintsville. It is. This one is on Robin Court. And if you're familiar with the Paintsville area, Robin Hill Road's a fairly popular area, mm -hmm. right kind of outside of town, but you're very, very um, close right there to Paintsville. Right. It's like if you get to where the ball fields are in Paintsville mm -hmm. or, or like you're going to go out Route 40, it's not even two or three minutes yeah. um, heading out toward the golf course. True. You're not even to the golf course yet. This is going to be right off to your left. And again, Robin Court is right off Robin Hill Road. And this one is a listing that they've just reduced the price on. And it is one of those perfect either downsizing homes or a starter home mm -hmm. for somebody looking for their first house. This is going to be one to look at. And I love the picture of the outside that we have, the first one. Uh, that shows that yard. Uh, it looks so clean and mm -hmm. neat, like something you would just want to move into. Exactly. And that's what, there's also a picture of that backyard mm -hmm. that shows that back patio. You can kind of see, you know, a little table and chairs out there enjoying the backyard. 1231 on the square footage, two bedrooms, one bathroom. Uh, but you've got plenty of parking. You've got a one-car carport and a one-car garage. And Paintsville is an area that a lot of people um, are attracted to these days. It's a growing town. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of times you're right off of US 23, so you're close to the Ashland Huntington area, but then on the other side you've got Pikeville, Prestonsburg. This is a very popular area. It is, and this again, like we said, mm -hmm. is right off Route 40, so the convenience is there. You're very close to the schools, very close to downtown Paintsville, close to the golf course, mm -hmm. shopping, all of that kind of stuff. So this is one that really puts you in the area that you'd want to be in Paintsville. And like we said, two bedrooms, one bathroom. Mm -hmm. So you mentioned either a starter home for that, mm -hmm. that first home for a newlywed couple, or you're an empty nester and you're like, we don't need all this space and you're downsizing. This is perfect for either one of those. Either one. And now that they've got the price down where they've just reduced mm -hmm. it, it's going to look even more appealing. Yeah, we're down to under $100,000 mm -hmm. for this one, $99,500. Now, this is Jeremy Duncan's listing, and he's out of the Paintsville office. So let's give some contact information for him. Okay, you can call Jeremy at 606-789-8119. All right, now let's move on our next one to another property that's just been reduced. We've mm -hmm. talked about it before, but this one is in downtown Pikeville. It is. This is in downtown Pikeville, right on Myra Barnes Avenue. And if you're familiar with that area in downtown Pikeville, it's a really nice residential area still in the downtown area. And it's just off Hambly Boulevard. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people don't realize that this area is back there. You've got two or three streets um, between the boulevard and the Pikeville Pond. Uh, that is a popular residential area for people who, especially with the active lifestyle. Absolutely. This is going to be a great location, not to mention you're very close to University of Pikeville, mm -hmm. the medical center, anything in downtown Pikeville, shopping, anything like that. And then, you know, talking about that active lifestyle and getting out in and, and the streets, you see a lot of times in that area vehicles parked on the street. But this mm -hmm. one's rare in that you have off-street parking. Yes, you do. You have an off-street parking that would allow probably three to four cars, so plenty of parking. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, you can park on the street if you needed more than that. But in downtown, having a driveway for three or four cars is a great amenity. Especially during hillbilly days. Yes. <laughs> Now on the inside, this one is spacious. We've got four bedrooms, two bathrooms, uh, over 2,300, almost 2,400 square feet. That fourth bedroom is actually an add-on. Could be a large family room or something like that, but makes a perfect master suite. Right. 
And this one, the price has just been reduced. So if you've looked at this one before and thought maybe in just a little bit out of your price range, uh, come back and take another look at this one because this is a motivated seller, I understand. Mm -hmm. So uh, they're going to try to do everything they can to make this at home attractive for you. Absolutely. And this is one that, yes, they are motivated, but once you go in it, I actually think you'll be pretty motivated to buy it. Yes, it's updated, they've taken care of it, and it's got a lot of charm. Mm -hmm. That's one of those that it's not your typical house that you, you walk in a house and you've seen that house. This one you have to see. Yes, absolutely. It's got a lot of charm, a lot of wood detailing, a lot of the original hardwoods, that kind of stuff. Now we mentioned that this price has just been reduced, so we're down to 205. So Jennifer, for everything you're getting in this location, this is not a bad price. It's not a bad price at all, and they can call the Pikeville office for more information on this house, mm -hmm. number 606-437-2333. All right, now we're going to transition from downtown living to living on the farm. <laughs> Literally, we have a farm for sale next. Absolutely. This one we've actually spoken about before also is on Upper Blackberry Road in the Ransom community. And this is one, you know, I'm the outdoor lover, so mm -hmm. I see 130 acres in this old farmhouse, and, and of course, I'm immediately drawn to it. It's really been well maintained, so if mm -hmm. you like the old farmhouse look, this is something you should look at. But just under 3,000 square feet above ground, and then they have unfinished basement that's almost 1,200 square feet. And this is a an area that's got a lot of history, especially mm -hmm. if you're familiar with you know, the Hatfield-McCoy feud. I mean, there are so many different things you can imagine doing with this house. Absolutely, absolutely. And this is one that really could have the potential to be, you know, a bed and breakfast mm -hmm. or something like that for the trail system. This is something that you could make into not just a residential property. Because you've got all the additional buildings mm -hmm. on the property, you have a lot of additional amenities that you could offer different people. So you've got pasture land, garden space, two barns, multiple storage buildings. So you really have room to do whatever it is that you're trying to do in that yeah, area. Yeah, I'm thinking ATVs, I'm thinking hiking, mm -hmm. even horse trails and, and horse riding and things. Or maybe you just want to escape the city life and have that farm out in the country. This is perfect for you. And this is one that you personally have listed. Uh -huh. uh, so let's give your email address on this one. The email is jbrown at rbnw.com. And the price on this one for everything, one ninety nine. Mm -hmm. So that is, is hard to beat in itself for everything you're getting. So the next one, let's kind of move and transition. Same general area in the county, but this one's more toward Phelps. Yes, this one is in the Phelps area, and if you're familiar with the Phelps intersection coming from mm -hmm. the Kemper or Pikeville area, you're going to get to that intersection and take a left, and this property will end up being on your right. This is one, it's again an older house built in 1950, but you can tell from the pictures that when it was built, it was built top of the line. Mm -hmm. And it really has a lot to offer because you have the main house, but you also have a garage with an apartment over it. So rental income or future mother-in-law suite, mm -hmm. something along those lines, allow this to also have a little bit of a income potential. And this is a large lot as far as a building lot. You've got half an acre, so mm -hmm. you've got a nice size yard, you've got this big big home, three bedrooms, one bathroom. On the outside, you have that huge patio with that fireplace. Mm -hmm. Talk about great entertainment space. I mean, isn't that just yes. picturesque? And then on the inside, you can also tell how spacious the rooms are just because of the kitchen uh, picture that we're showing. So you have really nice space and a really good entertainment room. And you've, you're showing the fireplace on the outside, but I see it. we've also got a big fireplace on the inside. Mm -hmm. And as cold it is, has been lately, a lot of people that don't have the fireplace are now thinking, our next home, we have to have a fireplace. <laughs> so we've got one for you on the inside and the outside for this house. Absolutely. And then they've also, they've enclosed a front porch to make it as like a bonus room, office space, fitness room, mm -hmm. anything like that. You really have just so much potential and it's so convenient in that Phelps area if that's the area that you want to be in in Pike County. And this one is Patty Hatfield's <laughs> listing, mm -hmm. and she's out of your Pikeville office. She is. So let's give that number. Okay. Number in Pikeville is 437-2333, or you can call Patty on her cell phone, 606-339-8794. Okay. Now we're going to end the show switching gears a little bit. Now we're going to talk about some rental opportunities. Now this is the newest and most popular place 
for anyone in Pikeville to live who is looking to rent? Yes, early. yes, absolutely. Um, Red Brown and Williams property manages the Pikeville Commons. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna kinda go over some of the details for that. If you're coming into Pikeville for school, for a job, anything like that, we highly recommend that you come over and look at the units. It's just a great place to live. And it's new. Um, these mm -hmm. are only a few years old. Uh, and we waited a long time for these because yes. I know that it was the big hype for a long time. And I've been personally in some of these units and they are nice. Yes, they are very nice. They include granite countertops. There's dishwashers in every unit mm -hmm. along with the other appliances, plus washer and dryers in every unit, which is a huge plus. Not having to carry your laundry up and down stairs to do, you know, like a community laundry room. So we've really, that's a popular amenity to have. And, and we're not saying washer and dryer hookups. We're no. saying the washer and dryer are already in these units. You yes. don't have to worry about bringing that in. Absolutely. Already there. So all your appliances, including washer and dryer, are ready, ready for you. And then something that really got me, if I was looking, the thing that would have sold this for me is this new area that you've got on the mm -hmm. bottom. Yes. The, the media area. You've got the big screen TVs, you put the pool table, all the games, and just a general sitting area. Mm -hmm. You want to all get your friends together and watch the big game, and we've got one coming up really soon. <laughs> um, th that's just a great place to gather. It really is, and the community space media room that we've just opened also, also has our office manager's mm -hmm. office in it. So she is there mm -hmm. Monday through Friday, nine to five. There's somebody on site to show you units, answer questions, anything like that. All of our tenants have access to that space with through a FOB system. Mm -hmm. So if you're a tenant there, you can come in, get a cup of coffee, watch the game, study, anything you wanna do. And then we are fully prepared to open within the next couple weeks. We have a workout exercise room, all the equipment's in. We're just waiting on the final touches for the uh, camera system that's going in, but cardio, free weights, circuit training machines, wow. all there free for our tenants to use as an extra amenity. And then, you know, in case you're not familiar with where Pikeville Commons is, it's the mm -hmm. newest area in Pikeville that's been developed lately. It's where your restaurants are, where your big shopping area is, mm -hmm. right off of Thompson Road. So you've got all your shopping, all of the newest and greatest that Pikeville has to offer as far as dining. And then too, Thompson Road, you, you're always seeing someone running or walking. It's an active lifestyle area too. You've got a, a river access mm -hmm. there. So you can take your canoe or your kayak up above town and float almost to your back door. So everything that this Pikeville Commons has to offer uh, is gonna be attractive. To absolutely. Anybody looking, no matter what you're here in Pikeville for. Yes, absolutely. We do have units currently available, one, two, and three bedrooms. So if you're looking, actively looking for a place to rent, please give us a call. And and if somebody wanted to come and look at the place, mm -hmm. I'm sure they can you can get a hold of your property manager and they can show them a unit. Absolutely. Stop in the property management office anytime Monday through Friday, nine to five. If that doesn't work, call the Pikeville office number, the 437-2333, set up an appointment and we'll get you in there. And a lot of people are going, wow, um, they may have not realized everything that Red Brennan Williams does. Uh, so that's something, definitely look at your website and, and everything you guys can do, they can look at that too. And that's rbandw.com. The home buying process can be stressful, but the agents of Red Rhino Williams want to assist you through the process. An agent can assist from start to finish. First, start with what you can afford. Getting pre-approved for a mortgage is typically a quick process and will allow a home buyer to look at homes that are well within your means. An agent can assist you with defining your wants and needs for your future home. Keep in mind, your wants and needs will probably change drastically as your home search moves forward. Lastly, work with your RBNW agent to navigate the current market to ensure your wants and needs are manageable and to efficiently place smart and well thought out offers on your home of interest. Buying a home can be stressful, but working with Red Brown and Williams agents can help alleviate that stress and make your home buying process a positive experience. Thank you for watching our show and we hope you will join us again soon.